boxing. And these guys are not letting the stand. Oh, he's in trouble. The big fella, the gypsy king, is rattled. He's stumbling all over the place. Do you believe it? Do you believe it? He's going, he's going. The referee might stop it. No! Yuri! Roddy Nation TV, welcome back to the channel. And the new undisputed heavyweight king of the world, Alexander Usyk. He beats Tyson Fury in a split decision to become undisputed world heavyweight champion. The judges scorecards read 115-112 Usyk, 114-113 Fury, 114-113 Usyk. Now, truth be told, the fight should have been stopped in the ninth round, but the referee gave um, uh, Tyson Fury a standing eight count and then after that happened the bell the bell rang and he was saved after that but it really should have been stopped in the ninth round now a lot of people a lot I hear a lot of people going around talking about how uh, Tyson Fury oh man we're giving Tyson Fury all this credit for for you know he just has this will not to fall down and 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 and, and you know he just wouldn't go down because if you watch that ninth round, he was getting beat, bro. I've never seen Tyson Fury get hit so many times in all in all the years that I've been watching him. I've never seen him get, I mean, from pillar to post, he got beat in that ninth round. And like I said, it should have been a stoppage. But nevertheless, Alexander Usyk um, came out victorious, and he's the undisputed champion of the world. Now, I watched this whole fight, and within this fight, Tyson Fury, even in the um, the lead up to the fight, it, you know how he is. He does a lot of antics. He try to he tries to get up under your skin and try to and try to get in your head before the fight. So basically, what I'm saying, he try to beat you before you even step in the ring with all these antics that he does. But Alexander Usyk, he wasn't having any of that stuff. None of it phased him. Even in the ring, when Tyson Fury was, um, you know, he, he liked to say he was having fun. I think he was. I think he was. He was getting beat, and he couldn't find anything else to do. So he started trying to showboat. You know what I'm saying? It kind of threw Usyk off for a little bit, but then he got right back in his bag. And you know, like I said, it was a good fight, but there was a winner. There was. You know, it was a, a, a clear definite winner it wasn't like it was that close or nothing like that like i said before it should have been stopped in the ninth round and tyson fury was doing some of the most dirty tricks of the trade uh hitting and holding behind the head holding behind the head and hitting uh just leaning on the dude just holding him and leaning on him and doing hitting below the belt the referee honestly man i don't know if i can watch another fight in dubai if they have if they're going to have referees like that i'm not sure if it's dubai or if it's the zone because this fight was sponsored by the zone and horrible refereeing the uh crowd was uh the crowd and the commentating was biased you know they were pro fury you know what i'm saying they were very pro fury and at the end of the fight tyson fury was said something that i really disagreed with he gonna say he says that uh he thought that he won the fight and the people are uh he said that this man's country is at war. So they're siding with the man, with this man because his country's at war. And that's the reason why Alexander Usyk um, won on the scorecards, which I really don't believe because really you should have been knocked out in the ninth round. That, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, the referee was horrible. The commentating, it, was, it, it, it wasn't, it, it was very biased. I'll say that. But as I said, we have a new undisputed heavyweight uh, champion of the world, and his name is Alexander Usyk. Now, there is a mandatory uh, rematch clause in there if Tyson Fury wants to, to, to take that. But what I've been hearing through the grapevine is that he might fight Anthony, Anthony Joshua uh, next. You know, that's, you know, he's probably, now that he got that loss, man, he might just cash out and just go for the money because that's a good fight and there's a lot of money uh, to be had in that fight. Those Arabs over there in Dubai, man, they, they got the bag and they dishing it out to people who want to come over there. You know, all the top fighters, you know, if you're a top fighter, they got the bag. All you got to do is just uh, go over there and get it. You know what I'm saying? If you want to put your record on the line and go to Dubai and get that bag, the Arabs are over there uh, giving it out. But like I said before, this was a very good fight, very entertaining. Congratulations to Usyk and congratulations to Tyson Fury. He did take a lot of punishment from pillar to post in the ninth round. 
And like I said, I'm not going to give you the credit for, you know, lasting that long because honestly, I thought you should have been knocked out. And the referee, um, you know, he um, destroyed that for for Alexander Usyk. But like I said before, congratulations to both guys. This is Rowdy Nation TV. Click the like button, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell so anytime I drop a video, you guys can be notified. We out.